What is going on with you guys? This is Brian Sam. I am Brian. I have another reaction video for you guys. This one has actually um, been recommended to me by, uh, his name is Eric? XX Eric 5X? I don't know. It's, that, shout out to him. He, he sent me this video. Not sent me it, but he, he told me to watch it. And, um, yeah, uh, if you guys watched one of the videos, the roller coaster one, I just kind of shared my whole thoughts about reacting to his channel because apparently people think I like to dick ride him or some shit. I don't. I just like his shit. I like his content. It's, I think it's funny. Um, and I'm just reacting to it just like any other person that reacts to any other video. Um, but if you don't like it, click it off. Like I said, click off the channel. Leave a dislike. I don't. It's not going to affect me. It's just uh, an opinion on the internet. I'm not stealing content or anything like that, but hey, let's go ahead and get straight into this video. It's called Math Class by Bruce Dew, and the link will be down in the description box down below. I'm going to just stop talking about the subject, you know, just like I said, positive vibes to this channel, and you're, you're free to share your opinion, but if it's something, you know, if it's a, sh there's, there's some things that are called shitty opinion, so if it's called a, if it's a shitty opinion, I'm just going to ignore it, like, come on now, we're, we're 2017, I don't really have time for internet wars all right i've had my fair share of psychopath teachers growing up but i think my sixth grade math teacher takes the cake he had a little bit of an anger problem and on the surface you wouldn't see it if you seen him in public you'd be like oh look at that guy he likes pringles and miller light probably all right but if you were a stupid kid in his math class well you got to see it firsthand because he hated stupid children which is unfortunate because he teaches sixth grade math he's surrounded by stupid children all it took is one stupid question and he'd flip his shit mr roberson does the percent sign go before before or after a number? <laughs> Anybody else got any stupid fucking questions? Huh? Anybody? I got 29 more bullets here. Oh He's the first teacher God. I ever heard swear in class, which uh, can be a little jarring the first time you hear it in a school setting. It's the order of operations, Daniel. You can suck my ass if you think subtraction comes before parentheses. What kind of simple bitch are you? Jesus Christ. Like, whoa, wait a minute. Something's not right here. You're a teacher. You're supposed to say happy words. You just had a lot of pent-up frustration. If you could just lay into the occasional kid, just maybe like an uppercut, <laughs> knock one out every once in a while. But no, this isn't the 1930s, where if a kid gets a wrong answer, you can like push a bookshelf on him or something. He'd always intentionally try to find the most nervous kid too. Make them answer problems on the board, just so he can make you look like a babbling idiot in front of the whole class. Hey Billy, why are you sweating so much? You're freaking everybody out. Why don't you tell us what you have for problem three? Uh, uh, 12? You high school nurse? If I have Billy pee in a cup, can you give him a drug test? Because he's obviously smoking crack if he thinks the answer's 12. I'm pretty sure you just go home at night, crack open 15 beers and just drink until he couldn't feel anymore. Go, 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 go. Honey, dinner's done. I made your favorite. Cigarettes and Xanax. How was work today? Fucking kids can't learn how to add fractions, Sharon. God oh damn it! Oh my god. And sometimes he wouldn't just spaz out on one kid. Sometimes he'd spaz out in the entire class. Like if we were sitting there and he was trying to teach us new concept, and we were just not getting it, and he's just looking at our blank faces knowing that not a single goddamn word he's saying sinking in. What the hell's he talking about? This is worse than long division. So one of his favorite things to do is uh, make us copy things out of the math book that we had. All right, little assholes, since you can't comprehend anything except your goddamn Pokemon cards, <laughs> why don't you get your math books out and copy pages 4 oh to 96? God. So we'd have to sit there and, like, sketch the actual page in the math book. Like the diagrams, the page numbers, the fucking copyright information in the front of the book. But I've never seen him as mad as the day he flipped out on my friend Corey. We're sitting there one day, learning how to add fractions or some shit, and Corey's over there fucking off all day in class like he always does, which makes him a prime candidate to be made an example of by Mr. Roberson. Hey, Corey, take your dick out of your hand and tell me what answer you have for the problem on the board. Uh, oh man, uh... Just add the numerators together, Corey. It's not that hard. Uh, numerators? Which number's the numerator, Corey? Uh, the bottom one? Motherfucker! Oh god, he's gonna kill me! It's simple goddamn addition, Corey. There are first graders who can't even wipe their ass proper. I could do this right now. I don't know. I don't know the answer. Can you wipe your ass properly, Corey? Not really, no. Corey, get your shit and go up to your first grade teacher and see if she'll let you sit in there and learn. Are you serious? Get the fuck out of my classroom! Now, if we all weren't scared shitless, 
we would have been losing it right now. Because the look on Corey's face was priceless. So sure as shit, Corey marched up to his first grade teacher's class to sit with a bunch of six-year-olds to learn basic addition and how to wipe your ass properly. Dude, Mr. Robertson, basic. send me up here to learn. Oh, and to ask you why you can't do your fucking job right. <laughs> now maybe I'm exaggerating a little bit on how psychopathic he was. He didn't shoot anybody with an M16. But if I am, I'm telling you right now, it's not by much. He was a psychopath, and his teaching methods were a little unorthodox, borderline abusive, you know, whatever. But I tell you what, I learned some goddamn mathematics, that's for goddamn sure. BruceDude.com Oh man. See, no, like, like I was talking about that little roller coaster video, and just right now, this, this is another video I can relate to because I hated math class, and I don't know. I had crazy teachers in ele elementary school also. Um, I don't have too much to say about just that whole... Um, what happened this week about, you know, getting comments about um, reactors and how they're fake. And I was like, what? There's so many people that do reactions and it's, it's kind of like pointless to kind of... I'm not saying you're, you're, you're free to, you know shout out your opinion or anything like that but uh real shit like i said if you don't like react reaction videos or my reactions just click off their their page it's like it's not hard why why are you gonna waste their time your time to just you know type out something like oh you fucking you suck you you steal content like come on now like we're you know what i'm not gonna say we're older than that because i'm pretty sure everyone that did you know put hey comments and say shit like that. They're probably liking their teenagers like 15 years old or some shit. But anyways, I hope you guys liked that reaction video. That was pretty funny to me. Um, this is Brian Sam. I am Brian, and you guys have a good day. Peace.